Hello my friends, welcome back to Hoogie Plays American Truck Simulator. <coughs> welcome to um, Yuma in uh, Arizona, close to the border of uh, California and uh, to Mexico, I think. At least not far from Mexico. We are here today to load up a trailer filled with uh, bricks that we will deliver in uh, Mexico in a place called San Felipe and um, almost 170 miles so uh, not the longest journey but uh, very suitable to um, make a video and um, here we are reversing up to the trailer uh, actually quite heavy since it it's uh, filled with bricks just see in the mirrors so that I I'm correct in place and uh, I think that's okay so the mean green machine with all the lights and uh, the brick trailer hooked on looks nice and uh, we are soon ready to go we will uh, just take a look at the map as you can see we are here in Yuma we will go uh, west and then south not uh, into the ocean but uh, at least south uh, into Mexico we will be there uh, late at night or late tonight so, time to uh, get going or get rolling. And, uh, see the the red turning lights, uh, the high mounted red. Oops, that was close. The high mounted red uh, turning lights there. I think they are. Very nice, well placed uh, actually, as long as you have a trailer that don't uh, go up all the way to the top of the cabin. And I really like this uh, green metallic color. I'm not sure though if I should stay with the red interior lights or if I should change them change that if you have any opinion on what if I should keep it or change it to any other color please let me know you can, uh, leave a message in the comment section but uh, well it will stay uh, stay for a while until I have decided as I said it's it's nice to have a color that that is not exactly the same as the interior color but on the other hand um, I think they have I think you can choose from red blue green and white or something like that and perhaps white is that cozy so uh, Red is good uh, when it's dark, and uh, blue is also good. So, uh, yeah, I will see uh, whether I will keep it or not. 
we uh, are soon uh, at the highway that will uh, take us west towards uh, San Diego and um, no this isn't right <laughs> sorry I'm a little unfocused here I will of course uh, enter the highway on this this uh, exit here so uh, yeah we will go uh, west towards uh, San Diego and uh, within a few miles we will uh, <laughs> I I'm sorry for that I cannot I cannot, I don't have the patience to stand uh, waiting uh, like those uh, AI trucks there. Uh, well, on the highway, on our way to uh, San Felipe in Mexico, I hope that you will come with me and uh, that you will enjoy the ride. So. Buckle up and um, I'll see you in uh, Mexico.
Looks like we are uh, coming into San Felipe here in New Mexico. Yeah, and uh, it's uh, late, late at night now, and uh, you can really see the the deeper red lights here of the interior lights when uh, when it's dark outside. And uh, well, I can I can go with that for a while. Everything has gone well. Uh, this this uh, road down here has been uh, quite quite a uh, challenge to drive uh, when it's dark because uh, there are a lot of a lot of turns on it. Actually, I thought that the road was supposed to be. Uh, straight but uh, no even if it could have been it hasn't it has been a lot of curves and turns so uh, perhaps I've been driving too fast but I'm not sure we will see if we can get our unloading spot here this is uh, this is a kind of facility where I have not been before. But we will of course take the 90 experience points uh, parking space, and it looks if we check the map. Now I now you can cannot see the map, but I saw it there. It looks like we are going around these containers in a way. And uh, you can bet your your uh, behind that we will go in between the containers containers or something like that. I'm not sure if you can go around them or if we're going to have to reverse in between but uh, because I think that it it's you can see this uh, this space there yeah I saw the cones so uh, let's try and make a nice exit here by reversing into uh, that gap looks like uh, looks like some sort of a harbor without any ships I really like the looks of this truck it's uh, it's uh, it's an incredible truck to uh, and they have made a very good job uh, building it and uh, modifying it and uh, yeah it was a very good choice i think i will of course probably not stick with this truck for the rest of my career but I really love it so I will definitely make some miles with it and uh, of course look for other trucks to uh, buy and uh, try as well Looks like we are doing a good job here. My friends, thank you for coming with me to San Philip in the middle of the night. Uh, please subscribe if you want to keep updated with more upcoming videos. Leave a comment if you have any and perhaps hit the like button. 
course you can also share this video with anyone that likes truck simulator videos that's perfectly fine with me it looks like I'm almost done with my uh, parking I have a green light on the cones so uh, now it's just to uh, hook up the trailer and uh, get some rest before I try and find a load out of here so uh, if you check in on me later you will uh, see where we are going the next time um, from me to you from San Philip take care bye bye